。哎，这 Q 也没中吗？Oh my god! Under the tower. What's up? Can you say outplayed? Next up, let's continue the ADC versus ADCs. MF Steam is trying to end the game, but so is Kindred and Tristana. But with Baron Empowered Recall plus Elder and a whole lot of damage, even the Lamb's Respite can't contain this misfortune. With 1105 AD Bloodthirster and Fleet Footwork, Air Versalis is healing 600 per auto. That is not fair, and neither is Phil literally 1v5 in the enemy base playing Beyblade Simulator. I don't know how Grumpy Gungan weaseled his way out of that headbutt pull, but now it's time to lay down the punishment. Cooldowns are down, wind wall is down, and it's the tiniest, tiniest things in League. Watch Yasuo's movement and his flow shield.
It's actually gonna live from that. Get you a homie like that Lissandra, or like this Lulu. This Jax is very strong and he's jumping the wall, but Lulu's ready with the instant whimsy, Shirelias, and exhaust. And you'll love to see that 1k shutdown on your hyper carry. Both teams are fighting hard for this mountain drag as it would be blue team's third. That being said, yeah, it's mountain soul, and these corridors make for some spicy combos. That's fine. Play slow, play slow. Double TP. They're gonna look to fight this. Fight, fight. Got good angle, I have good angle, I have good angle here. Oh my god, I'm at ball. Nice. Go, go swing, swing. I mean, Silas, sorry. Go mid, go mid, go mid, go mid, go mid. Next Everybody up, knows. disclaimer, this is Earth, but look at this build. All I'm gonna say is there's a reason this dude's name is Stepcog. With Baron coming up in one minute, everybody wants a piece of the Grumpy Gungan. Thankfully, his team is around the area establishing vision and ready to make him extra slippery.
drone. It's already 3v5. Vex and Nidalee have sacrificed themselves for Baron, but now everyone's whiffing and everyone's getting caught. However, Samira's already got over half her team's kills, and putting them on her back is nothing new to her. I'm loving this Eclipse build, because even versus a 200 armor Darius, this Kate is shredding. And speaking of shredding, just how insane are Aphelios' Chakrams with Press the Attack? Oh putain, faut que je back. Je suis mort. <rire> non yeah Yes Try anything and everything in Earth and you might just find a build this insane. Welcome to Alan Hit Vein. We got double AoE with Hydra Runons, plus true damage and magic damage from Silverbolts, Wits End, and Riftmaker. Oh, get your passive off. Oh, we're not a gotcha though. Color spot. Oh, I'm coming. You have exhaust. Scroated. You scroated. Can I get an assist, please? Thank you. Never Fight. So now, let's see if this might be the final fight right here. Huxtag Ultimatum comes down. That's going to be a great bullet time on the backside here, but the Zen Zonia Zarnaglas is going to keep them alive for just a little bit longer, but that execute on the Elder Deck is way too strong. That's going to be two kills for the Misfortune. Make that three. Triple kill oh, so far. Can they find number. more? Falcon is pretty low here, so they do have to be careful. Young Broke Boy is on the edge. That's going to be making it rain. Coming across. Triple quadra. Oh. Penta kill. 
Falcon comes out big, ends the game. Thank you so much for watching. That is going to do it for today's episode all on ADCs. Remember to leave a like if you did enjoy and subscribe for some more good stuff like this daily. Until next time, take care, stay safe, and have yourself a wonderful day.